Well, in other news today, the communications minister, Montegun Gubele, says it's just a matter of time before the rest of the country is switched off from analog terrestrial television and everyone moves to digital terrestrial television as part of the two-step approach by government. The minister says a number of uh, issues have been hampering the process, including low shedding, are being addressed in order to digi digitize the entire country, including rural areas. The minister officially switching off the last analog transmitter that transmitted above 694 megahertz in Stellenbosch today. Minister, thank you so much for your time. Talk to us about this process and how important it is. I remember a while ago in the National Assembly, a talk about the 4RI uh, and now there's the AI. Everybody's like talking about uh, the advancement of technology. So how important is this element then for government to ensure uh, progression in terms of digital communications? Access to, dig to digital infrastructure creates many opportunities. Uh, technological development, in particular for young people who've got access, and the improvements of capabilities to apply many solutions that our people don't have. For instance, um, a week ago, we were in person Jones. No, not in person Jones. Uh, somewhere in one event in the Eastern Cape, where they were saying to us, or in the church, where they were saying they have developed an app for initiation, so that if your brother is in the mountain, you are able to follow his state of health, his vital signs, his state of breath, and so on. You know when to jump in, take him to hospital. That's what digital era is about. It's providing multiplicity of solutions in many problems that society is confronted with. Now that we are actually switching off here, allowing telcos to go on top of 694 megawatts, it means now they are able to move and manufacture their 5G and a number of other key enablers for many to access as much digital space as possible to do the best human beings are capable of doing. We also want to say to all the entities of the department, be it CENTEC, BBI, SAPO, and all of them, on behalf of the department and government, I want to express my gratitude uh, for the work they have done in collaboration. And I want to thank South Africans, telcos and everyone else for their ability to wait until we find our way where they are able to access the most efficient spectrum they have been yearning for.